Like this video and subscribe my YouTube channel. HR Derby Anthem singer Ingrid Andrus says she was drunk. After a widely panned performance of the U.S. National Anthem at the MLB Home Run Derby, country singer Ingrid Andrus apologized Tuesday and said she was drunk. I'm checking myself into a facility today to get the help I need, she posted on social media. That was not me last night. I apologize to MLB, all the fans, and this country I love so much for that rendition. Major League Baseball is not commenting, spokesperson Matt Bourne said. A representative for Andrus said there will be no additional comment at this time. Andrus, 32, is the daughter of former Major League strength and conditioning coach Brad Andrus, who worked for the Detroit Tigers, Colorado Rockies and New York Mets. Ingrid Andrus has been nominated for four Grammys, including Best New Artist in 2021. On Monday night, Andrus belted an a cappella version of The Star Spangled Banner, an incredibly challenging song to sing. Clips of her less than popular rendition at Globe Life Field in Arlington, Texas, have since made the rounds on social media. Andrus began her career as a Nashville songwriter before signing a deal for her own music and releasing her debut album in 2020. She released a sophomore album in 2022 and on social media has been promoting a new single that was scheduled to be released next week. This isn't the first time a performance of the national anthem has been panned. In the pantheon of controversial renditions of the national anthem at sporting events, Roseanne Barr's performance at a 1990 San Diego Padres game and Fergie's at the 2018 NBA All-Star Game resulted in similarly negative reactions. Country singer and Texas native Cody Johnson performed the national anthem without a hitch before Tuesday night's All-Star Game. Johnson walked toward the microphone between the mound and home plate at the home of the Texas Rangers wearing a white cowboy hat and cream-colored blazer. He removed the hat just before he started singing and raised it in his right hand several times along the way. Nice Horse, the Canadian duo of Katie Rocks and Brandy Sidoric, sang the anthem for that country before Johnson's performance. The harmony-filled version went smoothly as well. Johnson, 37, had already thrown out a ceremonial first pitch at Globe Life Field earlier this season before drawing the assignment for the anthem.